Hello everyone, it's your girl Nadesh Mvelu, a content creator based in Yaoundé, Cameroon. If it's your first time to see this beautiful, cute face, you're definitely welcome and please consider subscribing. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. I appreciate you for always coming back. Guys, pardon my voice. I don't know. I don't have kata. That's, I don't have cough. I don't have, my nose is not flowing. But I have sore throats, like it's disturbing seriously. But I bought drugs already, and I think it's better. I take lemon and honey and fever grass. Hey guys, this is very early, like this is seven o'clock. I got up with this idea. I don't know what's happening to me. Have social media influenced me? Have social media affected me or what? Guys, I didn't sleep the whole night because I was dreaming of one particular thing that I saw on social media. Social media precisely on YouTube. Ah. Let me ask you first this question. Do you get influenced by social media what you see? Or you are just kind of person like you see and you are not bothered, you continue living your life? Be it good or bad. Sometimes you can see something and influence you to do better in your own things. Sometimes you are just indifferent. You continue doing your thing, you know. I'm not a perfect person. I most of the time I get influenced. First, if I see a video and I like it, I always want to try to produce that kind of video or better. Second thing is, guys, this have not happened to me in a long time. Like I, I don't even think it have ever happened to me. This um, a content creator here on YouTube. I watch her a lot. I love her. You guess who she is? She's chopping her life. She's chopping money. <laughs> and I like her because she's working the money, even though her husband is spoiling her. But she's working the money, she's chopping. I love that about her. She has influenced me, guys. I dream of what she cooks because several times she has talked about it in her vlogs, in her videos showing a little tips of how she cook it that's who she is first and it have influenced me like this night i couldn't sleep maybe because i was hungry before i slept i don't know but i dreamt of it so much that today i just got up i wrote a list gave it to my help go and buy me this and bring it back home i want to cook it now and i'm cooking it for you guys i'm taking you guys along it's pepper stew chicken something like that seriously but i don't know you can just chew it without frying. What I know is you didn't fry it. And from the outcome, it was so delicious. I'm talking about Nelo okay, okay. <laughs> like, if you're on this street, you don't know Nelo. Who are you? From where to where now? I, I believe everyone that's a YouTuber knows Nelo okay, okay. For those who are not YouTuber, Nelo okay, okay is a Nigerian YouTuber. She's that content creator I love so much. Seriously. On 100, I love her 95. 95 is more 99. I love her so much. I love her because um, I love enjoyment. I will not even lie. I love enjoyment. And I love when a woman is working and enjoying that money. And I love when a husband says, Come and spoil you with his own money. Not your money, he will spoil you with his own money. So I just love it. I just can't, I can relate to that being spoiled, yes. So I just love it, like somebody showing it. I'm always too afraid to show everything like that, like that. But I just love her confidence. I just love the fact that every morning she gets up, she says, like when she wants to hold her camera, she says, this is Nelo with a fresh face. Guys, I love it so much. Like I love when somebody has confidence, like yeah, I have a fresh face. And I got that from her, telling myself every time with a beautiful face. Like I appreciate myself every time. I was not that kind of person that I love appreciation, appreciate myself. Since I started watching her series, I've gained confidence. I'm like, oh, this with a beautiful face. Whether you can see the beautiful face or not, uh -uh, it's from within, it's from inside. So I want us to cook it. In this vlog, we'll be seeing my cooking like this pepper stew. When he comes out from the market, I'll show you guys what he bought, like what exactly I'm using. And what I noticed that they eat it like that, like without anything. And that's my best, like, I will save all the pots. That pot is just for me because I'm putting pepper. Mm. This is we want your pepper will shop. But most of it is for me because it's already full plan for the house. That one is special meal. I was just so craving that food. Like I didn't sleep because of the craving. I got up in the night and I was thinking about it. I was thinking of the process on how I will cook it. Like, that's the first thing. I don't love cooking. I cook when it's necessary. 
So I don't believe I dream of how to process food, how to, and I'm, I'm not that kind of foodie person. I don't love food like that, like that. Mm -mm. I'm not fan of food. Chicken is not one of my favorite. I don't even have a favorite meat. So chicken is not that kind of thing that I will sit and crave. I want to eat chicken. No, no. Enjoy the vlog and see you guys later. Okay, guys. This is I went to Santa Lucia and uh, I got some two articles I really love. I got this planche de coupé. It's a chopping board for fruits. Like, I will use it for fruits. Let's unbox it together. And use this place to cut your fruit. Then when you finish, you keep it back this way. Or you can either use it this way. I think it's preferable this way. I really love it. I got it for, I don't even know the price. Then, ooh, perfect same room. Like, I saw this from Elvin Jig's channel. Elvin Jig is a YouTuber here. I'm sure you know her. So, Evan Jig is a YouTuber based in Yaoundé. She's my coco. She's like, I love her content so much. Guys, go and subscribe to her channel. Please, please go and subscribe to her channel. And tell her, thank you on my behalf. She got this from Santa Lucia, I don't know, and she just told me. So, I went to the Santa Lucia Mokoro and I found the same thing. I was so happy. This is it. Let's just put the cereal inside. Let me wipe it first. Yeah, we'll be cooking together. So I got because. Wow. Oh, I love it. And I can't go to Santa Lucia without getting this banana popcorn. Guys, this thing is the best. But let's just jump into the cooking. Let's cook one time. My things just are. Pepe, as I said, because this pepper chicken is not for children. It's not uh, agri fowl. This is corn drink. Like I will put the different. You see the different. Of you see this kind of strong and that like it's really strong. And today I'm killing myself. I came with some eggs, <laughs> guys. Let's just start cooking together. This is three minutes after it just boiled. I didn't put oil there. I can see oil already. And this oil is from the chicken. Yeah, I see one full bean. How small it is. It's really small like I can finish this alone. I'll never lie. It's really small. Later, flashback. Hello, guys. I don't know why I want 
I want to start this video now and I'm putting this camera this way because of that so many people is raining and people have packed like people have ran from the rain when I put my phone up they're like looking at me like it's I decided to put it down I'm going to shave my son and I just want to take guys along <laughs> does that make sense yeah I have a very busy day I want to shave my son I want to buy some stuff some basket uh, laundry basket some kind of small things so I'm taking you guys along let's go Okay guys, as I was saying, I just finished shaving his head. I'm sure you can see it. He's finished shaving his head. Do you go through the same struggle like I do? Like when I want to shave my son's hair, it's like I'm going to shave my own hair. Because I have to wear the garment they are wearing. Because everything will split on me. And I have a problem with his hair. I'm that mom that wanted to see my son with that kind of comb. Like something in front, hair in front, shape. That kind of stylish, swaggish disappointed because he has first of all no hair i don't know the hair i'm not growing and he has a problem with the skin i'm coming here for help i'm crying for help at this point he has a problem with the skin he has a very fragile skin like everything anything irritate him when you shave him it started when i started shaving him i started shaving him when he was six months because his hair was not growing, I wanted his hair to grow for one year birthday, you know that kind of thing expected, knowing that when I shave his hair, it will grow back. <laughs> I was shocked. I was shocked. I shave it not to grow, it still grow the same as I leave it. I started using Cantu product, it didn't work. What did I use again? I used uh, coconut or it didn't work. For his body, it's worse. I started using Mistela, it didn't work. I went to Chloran Baby, it didn't work. I even went to a Camarilla brand that ah, that was the worst one. I didn't want to mention them. So I went to coconut oil. That's what he's using. It's better. It's not working actually. It's not doing anything on his skin, but it's better. At least his skin is fresh, looking good, that kind of thing. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Do you know this? Like every time he will just get up and you see something like something high on his head. Like nothing happened he didn't fall something at first i used to think that he fell something on mosquito bike nothing we don't even have mosquitoes in the house but i do everything possible to not to have mosquitoes so he has that kind of bad skin that he can just sit and you see things all over his head and now i have a problem this thing i don't know how they call it a ringworm imagine on, on his head like is that bad like please what can i use i'll show you guys what i'm using this is actually what i'm using now i bought it in the pharmacy I bought it and I don't know if it's working because in two days I decided to shave. I just pray it turns out better. Please, if you have a solution about that skin, especially with something I can buy in Cameroon, it will help me a lot. Please, if you have anything that you think I can use for this body, please tell me in the comment section or DM me on my Instagram account. Nadesh I'm buying so many things. I'm going to Vatican to take a phone, the send. What more? What more? I have so many things to do. I'm going to pick to a friend like I have this friend that I've not seen like four years and today she decided to come and see me so I'm going to pick her up that's all I don't know let's just go together and see what happens hey yo this is my friend came to visit me this is bonjour amazable bonjour it's a good one it's in a flashback the very next evening guys i want to improve the way i do hair so i decided to do hair by myself and this is me braiding my girl's hair you guys will see the end and wait me my hand work can you see what i did <laughs> It's not perfect, seriously, but I'm trying. 